I'm Dan Fitzpatrick at StockMarketMentor.com on January 8th, it's Wednesday, and we're looking at Medbox here. Okay, um, I'll cut to the chase here. You need to sell this stock if you're if you're long. Uh, I could totally be wrong about this. It could go clear up to 100 bucks and beyond. It's just amazing how high this thing could go. Um, this is not the next Twitter, though. Um, the technically. This is about as classic a reversal pattern as you could get. Um, the only way it could be more convincing is if this was down a little bit more and this bar was up a little bit higher. But make no mistake about it, pretty nice artwork, huh? Um, this is a this is a gap in crap. It's a gap in reverse. Look how high this thing has gone in just one, two, three, four, five, six, seven eight days it reversed first thing this morning and I mean frankly if you're holding this stock and expect it to go higher from here you know I, I don't want to say you're a dope but I'm just gonna say that you know you're probably smoking something that comes out of this machine uh, that this company makes look their website makes it sound like it's really really cool when you have to even go posting um, testimonials from your customers on your website you're blowing a bubble baby that's all I mean you can bet I mean this is a it's a pink sheet stock it's a stupid stock um, back here a year ago look where this puppy was selling for a whopping two cents so this is just not where you want to be they say that it they produce or manufacture automated biometrically controlled dispensing and storage systems for medicine and merchandise okay I have a gun safe that does the same thing that cost me about 80 bucks or so the only difference is this is for medicine and merchandise otherwise known as pot and it's got a you know a refrigeration system in there so your pot doesn't rot you swipe a card and then you put your fingerprint on there this is not high-tech stuff I'm sure they have things that are patented and that's just great but let's look real quick and then I'll let you go at the fundies here because they're really impressive they have a hundred thousand dollars cash on hand so do I they have a total debt of two hundred and forty thousand more than I do um, their profit margin is seven point six two um, mine kind of dwarfs that by quite a bit um, they also make uh, they've got a market cap of eight hundred and seventy million so they've kind of got me on that no question about it um, they've got a revenue of 5.94, let's say 6 million a year. Um, I'll admit it, that's better than me. They have a ticker, I don't, unless you want to call it FITZ or SMM for stockmarketmentor.com. But the bottom line is, this is just a bubble stock. Um, we're all looking for the next Tesla or Twitter or whatever it is. I'm just telling you, this is not it. It's just not it. I see that, you know, you can look at the, you know, big percent move, big huge percent move in the down direction today. If you are long the stock thinking that, you know, this is a buying opportunity, this was your buying opportunity. It is absolutely not too late to sell. Again, I could be wrong. I'll admit that. You go ahead and text me or tweet me or whatever you want to do when the stock hits 150, um, telling me that uh, I must have been smoking the stuff that I was, um, you know, criticizing in telling you this. But I'm just saying, I've seen this before. I was trading last century when we saw this kind of stuff happen. And at some point, the music stops and you would be amazed at how few chairs there are to sit down. So at 5310, I'll have to look tomorrow, but I'm hoping there's shares um, that are available to borrow because I'll be shorting the snot out of this thing and looking to cover it at maybe 30 bucks, probably 25, and and even then only if the market's still giddy. Members, get to the strategy session and we'll tell you what to do rather than what not to do.